Okay, what's up, motherfuckers? I was about to talk about the vet. We put some wheels on it. Finally got some better wheels. But we don't have a fucking. We don't have the fucking lock. The lock for the wheels. I I, I could have sworn it was in the car. I looked in the car. It's not there. I looked in the trunk. Looked at all the other cars. I'm rapping and I'm capping. We I have no idea where lock, it is. So we're gonna come back to the motherfucking block. All right, whatever. Anyways. <laughs> I'm gonna go to AutoZone, get the fucking lock for them, and I'll probably get some different lug nuts because I really don't want these wheels to fall off. But I picked up some C6 wheels just for now, I guess, temporarily. It's 18 by eight and a half in the front, 19 by 10 in the rear. Even though there's some 235s on there right now, they're stretched on there. I think it'll go to 285, maybe even, bro, I'm gonna be scratching my shit. Back. Maybe even 295. All right, right now we're gonna go get some lug nuts. We're gonna get the wheel lock for the vet, and then I believe we will be getting the vet dyno tune. Hopefully, hopefully he says it's you know it's there's not really shit wrong with the car. It was just running bad, or it just needed a tune. I don't think it was tuned after the long tubes. I'm not sure if that would cause it to act the way it's acting. It did have a check engine light and then it went away on its own. So maybe with just a retune will be gravy. I'm hoping for 400 horse. I'd be really happy with anything over 400. Um, I wanna see that before and after. I've always wanted to get a car tuned. Always, always in my whole life. This is the first car I've ever gotten dyno tuned or just tuned at all. So it's gonna be pretty cool, you know, to see it what it makes without the tune and then what it makes after he does his magic or whatever i'm hoping to pick up a lot of horsepower because i figure the car is not running how it's supposed to be running at all all right guys so we came to get the wheel lock and then we got a bunch of lug nuts just in case the ones with the wheel lock don't work but i called my boy and he said he's ran the wheel lock lug nuts with c6 wheels before so if those work then i'll just keep those and i'll just return those or maybe save them for another bucket but yeah man let's get these fucking wheels on so we can head to the dyno shop and put down a good 60 horsepower we're just gonna use these i think it'll be fine um i'll bring a uh tire iron and the wheel lock with me of course but it should be good. Just put them on. It's over there. Let's see how this is going to fit. See that fitment, baby. We could go wider for sure. Oh my god, that looks hella small. What the fuck? We'll see when it's, how it looks when it's lower, but we got to go way wider. Those are 235s. Alright, we got three or four of them on. It's jacked up on the other side, but these rear tires definitely need to be changed for some wider johns i went ahead and got the 2024 sticker feel me we all registered we all ready to go gotta get this one on gotta just get the front one on and we're getting the fuck out of here there is an e-brake cable and some other shit hanging back here i just cut it because fuck the e-brake and then there was a wheel speed sensor right here that wasn't plugged in so i'll plug that in as well so we don't have a bunch of shit dangling back there putting all these other wheels away if you want them DM me, you can have them because I definitely don't got space for them. Last one. All right, guys, we got the wheels on. It looks good. Uh, it doesn't seem to rub. Wheels maxed out. I maxed them out both ways. It seems cool. Man, if y'all want some fucking merch, tap the fuck tap in. Tap the man. fuck in. We're about to have an event coming soon. He'll have all the merch there. Tap the fuck in. Stop sleeping. All wheels are on. I uh, definitely probably get some tires tomorrow um i need to go way wider than that because i wanted the fitment to look good but other than that it's not all scraping the floor and shit seems cool i'm about to get gas and then we're on our way to the tune shop slowly but surely the vet is coming along uh, i'd say the next thing to do would really just be get tires fix the hydro and then it's just little shit like i found like a little broken mount for the sway bar on one of the sides so i'll get that little mount it's just little shit after that 
little fucking whatever the fuck goes right there so it don't get all hot and shit. All right, guys, we were literally two fucking minutes away from the tune shop. And as soon as I turn this corner, I'm like giving it gas and it's not responding at all. And then boom, just dies, won't start. <laughs> what the fuck? So, I don't know. I see this is kind of wired up. Maybe something from here. Or I see electrical tape here. Maybe something from there. Loosen. Okay, so I don't think it was those wires right there. But there was a fuse. There was a fuse that was like to a relay or something. And it was like barely even making contact. Like it would like it almost completely fell out. And then I pushed it in and it started right up. So we're two minutes away, man. Bro, get the shit out of my face. Or we're now pulling up to the shop to get a dyno tune. We just got here. Oh yeah, boy. The homie last time with the 6B G35 pulled up with the 40,000 mile G8. You just hit 40K, huh? Yeah, yeah. On the way here. On the way here. This motherfucker is nice. I think that'd be sick as fuck. But um yeah, tomorrow I gotta go get these wheels balanced because that one's wobbly as fuck. And it drives kind of sketch. Gotta fix that little shit on the sway bar in the back. And then we'll really see what this motherfucker can do. We got 355 so far boys. Hopefully we can squeeze some more out of it. The 40,000 mile GA, baby! What the fuck? Bro, put that bitch in first! A G8 now. That shit sounds clean. <laughs> yeah, that feels clean. Let me throw my seatbelt on. I feel okay. I know. I trust. I trust 500 James. I would it. Hey man, you don't know me. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, just uh, do partial throttle down the street real quick. Do partial and go into full. Check if it's going. Come and then come back and show me. His keyboard? Yes, sir. Oh, he forgot it? Yeah. Go straight? Or should I like flip no, it? No, you can make it U-turn here. If you want to, you can swing it on the other side. I'll just do a full. Okay. It's 
things with the fuses. They were all flying everywhere. And the battery was hella loose. This is gonna be our pull now.